We are your local election headquarters. The Democratic candidate for Vermont governor laid out her agenda if elected at a news conference today. Esther Charleston said the housing and climate crisis are her top two priorities. She also called out Governor Phil Scott's response to recent flooding, saying the state needs more prevention efforts, including investing in renewable energy. Now we can be the first to achieve a 100 percent renewable grid by 2035. But that won't happen with a governor who has vetoed or hasn't engaged and made an effort to move towards these initiatives. Charleston says she has the support of some Democratic elected officials, including progressive Burlington Mayor Emma Mulvaney Stanick. Charleston is challenging the country's most popular governor. For his part, Phil Scott has spent this campaign season mainly stumping for down ballot candidates. In fact, tonight he is in Fairfax supporting a state Senate candidate. Scott says he's trying to elect more common sense candidates to the legislature who will put partisanship aside. He too is campaigning on making the state more affordable. Scott's team has an ad out right now alongside Republican John Rogers, who is running for second in command.